What's going on, guys? Nice turnout so far. Good to see everybody. Wow, we're flying today. Lots of people here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen students. Wow. That's more than two thirds. Pretty cool. Got it. Adonis, I got your soul study, so it's all good, bud. You figured it out, I guess, right? Guys, make sure you click the live button in the corner so you know that you're uh, current with what we're doing right now. Let's see what else we got going on here. Guys, I want to spend a little bit I'm trying to do a backflip. Okay, good, Donis. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Okay, real quick, I want to go over some of the uh, the math. Most of you guys handed everything in. I still didn't get Aaliyah's back. Daniel's, I got to get back. And Adonis's social studies. Math, who's, who I didn't hand in, who I didn't check yet. Allison, Matt. Daniel, Ava, and Julia Ferrioli. I didn't check yours yet. I'll check up a little bit. I'm going to give you some answers now, though. Uh, the writing assignment, the boxes and bullets that I wanted done. Uh, one handed in. Allie, I just didn't get to yours to grade yours yet, but I don't have Aaliyah's, Matt, Daniel's, Adonis's. I don't have Kira. I don't have Julia Ferrioli. I don't have Ava. I don't have Brianna's. I don't have Emily's, and I don't have Dylan's. That's with the writing. Ali, I don't think I got what did I not get though. What did I just say? The writing, Ali, I didn't get. You're missing the writing. The writing a claim statement is what you should be looking to hand in to me today. Writing a claim statement. And I also didn't get the math from you, Aliyah, from today. I think the math I didn't get from Dean. I didn't get from Aaliyah. Dean, you look like you're about halfway done from what I have here. A little less than halfway done. One full page done and a half a page done. Is that correct? Dean, is that correct? Missing a little bit? Of course. Okay, uh, we're going to start with the claim statement. The claim statement is on participation trophies. You're supposed to put what you want. I gave you an example of mine, which was uh, school uniforms. Yours was on uh, participation trophies, and you should have listed the three main reasons. That's all you had to do to hand it in. Okay, Kara, thank you. Okay, so I know, Bobby, you did uniforms. I hope you fixed that. Uh, cause we weren't doing uniforms. You're doing class particip I mean, uh, participation trophies. Uh, make sure you're handing the correct one. You didn't, we didn't do research on school uniforms. I just made that one up. Okay, Dan, that's fine. Hand in what you have. So I know where we are. We had plenty of time to think of three reasons though. We gave you plenty of articles. I was hoping you guys had at least three done, but if you don't have it done yet, do the best you can. So now's the time, guys. If you have any specific questions, I'm going to go over some of the math with you, compatible numbers, why I have 18 of you here, which is a record. I'm glad you're done, guys. I don't care if you're done, only if you have a question. 
If you're done, you say, I got to hand it in, that's fine. But if I have it and it's done, I know it's done. Thank you, Christian. I know it's done if you handed it in. The math, I just want to go over compatible numbers with you real quick. And we'll go from there. And then I'll take any questions that you have in the sidebar. All right. Uh, compatible numbers. Uh, do me a favor. Matt, if you did the math, you again, you forgot to tick, turn in. I oh, know, Matt, I have you turned in. Aaliyah, Dean, Emily, Dylan are the only math I'm missing. So everybody else is good. That's fine, Daniel. Take your time. I, I already answered that one already. Okay, couldn't load the example. I don't know why you couldn't load the example, Julia, in all honesty. All you had to do was click it. That's it. Just click it. It goes right up. Yeah, I'm holding it. It's actually a back scratcher. Very good eyes, Julie Ferrioli. 14 on the math. Is that one of the ones I'm going to go over? The only ones that should have been hard on math was the division ones. Let's see. Yeah, 14 was division. So that's all good. We'll work on that. I'm looking over my math now. I'm missing page three somehow now. I don't know where. Uh, who knows what's going on? There you go. 14, yep. 14 was, it, when you know how to do it, it's very simple. I have trouble I'm going to, to hand it in today. Almost done. Good. Ava, me too. Kira, I have trouble. 14, too. It was easy for me. Yeah, Bob, it was so easy for you that you handed in school uniforms today. Please. Yeah, Daniel, that's fine. The division ones were hard because there is no such thing as uh, a simple rounding for division. It doesn't exist. Yeah. Okay, let's look at 14 then. Everybody take a look real quick. I want to show you. I'm trying to see if I can see it. My eyes are just getting so bad, guys. Okay, it was this. Okay, real quick. Take a look. There it is right there. Okay? Now, whenever you're doing compatible numbers, the dividend, I want you to, whenever you do that, I just want you to do this. We've done this in class before. Just focus on the first two numbers. Everything else is going to turn to zero. Everything else. So you're just focusing on those two numbers. So it actually looks like this now. Take a look. Tell mom I have glasses, but I need like, uh, I need uh, glasses that I could see closer. So these are for distance. Okay, this is what it should look like right here so far, okay? I'm only worried about these, the first two numbers. That's it. And you notice I put the decimal down? So the decimal is there? Okay, then I say to myself, let me skip count by seven and get as close to that number as I can. The number was 63, right? Even though it's six and three tenths, I'm only going to worry about 63, okay? Yeah, magnifying glasses, exactly. So now look, I'm going to skip count by seven. And I'm going to try to get as close to 63 as I can. And look, if I skip count by seven, seven, 14, 21, 28, 35, 42, 49, 50. Look at that. I actually get right at 63. So those two numbers in the blank, I put in that number. Now I have this. Okay, and then I just do simple division. I should have ended up with 90 hundredths. And that could be simplified very simply to 9 tenths. So very important when you guys got to understand when it comes to compatible numbers, you're only worried about, you're only worried about the first two numbers in the dividend. So if I go back to question, my dog's at it again, guys. If we go to question number eight, this is what eight looked like. 
Take a look. Tessa, come here. Okay. So now watch, guys. You're only going to look at these two numbers here. Remember? Everything else is going to turn to zero. So just look at that. Just look at those first two numbers. So our equation is going to look like this. Blank, blank, decimal, zero. Take a look. You notice the six? Nothing happens to that six. It stays six. Blank, blank, zero, zero. I'm only gonna, now I'm going to skip count with six. Get as close to 38 as I can. Okay, ready? Skip count by six. Six, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, 42. Now, look, we want to get, I just skipped counted by six. We want to get as close to 38 as we can. There's our numbers. Which number is closest to it? 36 or 42? 36 is the closest. So now on those two lines, I put those numbers in there. And now I have this. And I say, okay, 6 goes into 36 six times. So my answer, 6 decimal zero. Bobby, what kind of answer are you writing there, Bobby? Everything else, Bobby, turns to zero. Mister, it's so easy. That's There's no other six there, Bob. I hope that was a miss. Thank you, Bobby. Okay. Now, that's compatible numbers, guys. I, it, you guys make it look like it's the hardest thing in the world. You worry about the first two numbers and the, and the divisor. You skip counting. You try to get as close to it as you can. That's it. It's that simple. Do you guys hear Tessa or no? Tessa, come over here. Come here, see me. Come here. Come here, see me. Come here, see everybody. Come here. Come look who's here. Come here, look. Look who's here. Say hello to everybody. They all hear you barking, Bubba. They all hear you barking. She can't help it. She just is so excited. All right, go lie down if you're not going to say hello to everybody. Matt, your answer was five for that one. Well, how'd you get five? Did you five is not going to work, Matt? Because look, we had to get to thirty-six. Thirty would have been five, and thirty is not closer to thirty-eight. Thirty-six is closer to thirty-eight. Forty-two is closer to thirty-eight. Thirty doesn't work. You see why that's wrong, Matt? Okay, I can live with a miscount. I can live with a miscount. She is a cutie pie. Okay, let me see. I'm just getting text messages here left and right. I don't know why. I don't, I'm not going anywhere. Text messaging me. I don't want to talk to anybody. Uh, let me see. Okay, so what other questions have you been having? Are there any other questions that you have? With the math. Today was, was estimating. Remember what estimating is. <laughs> Yeah, I'm popular. I don't want to talk to nobody, Julia. Stuck in my house with three kids, all learning three different programs in school. You guys driving me bananas with compatible numbers. Me and Ryan hung out today on the computer for 20 minutes, didn't we, Rai Rai? Getting it right. Remember, don't Daniel, do not drive mom crazy. Just FaceTime me. It'll solve itself. Everybody take it easy. Good. Matt, ask away. Give me a question, Matt. You guys I'll talk to all day. These guys are going to ask me, when is soccer starting? Is school, you think school's going to get started? Uh, I don't have the answers. Daniel, I love talking to you yesterday. It was awesome. We lost David's comment. I'm waiting for a question. Yes, Julia, we know you like being social. That's very true. I don't mind it either, but I just don't have any answers for anybody right now. I wish I did. We have 22 more days. Let's pray. Let's pray that that's all we have. We want you to sing. <laughs> I'm not in a singing mood today. I'll tell you that right now. I'm not in a mood to sing. Okay. 
that whenever I try to type, it won't. <laughs> Matt, you and those fingers, you just have to double click. There's no way that it works for everybody, but it doesn't work for you. There's something you're not doing right. But if you can't figure it out, Matt, write it out and take a picture and send it in. That's not the end of the world. So if you, I cannot fix you with the technology stuff. It works. You just got to double click it. If it's not working, I can't help you because 18 people handed it in already. So it is working. So if you're having issues with it, that's fine. Just take a picture. Oh, thank you. Just take a picture and send it in. That's fine. I don't know what to tell you, Matt. I wish I could help you. If you want to FaceTime later, uh, we we'll, we could work it out. We could try to anyway. But again, I'm not good with computers. Matthew Johnson, bite your tongue. It is not going to be more days off. We're going to be back together soon. Real soon. Aaliyah, they just said they didn't tell you exactly May 1st. They're, 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 they're taking it two weeks out of time, the government. So they keep going. If you're noticing, every time they cancel, it's two weeks out of time. So hopefully by the time the next two weeks go, that they don't say May 15th. Hopefully they say, yeah, May 1st. But we don't know. Nobody knows. April 29th was the day, right? That it that it that it will start back up. But I'm a happy I'm a happy person right now, guys. I was getting a little frustrated. You know, I needed the Diet Coke. I know you guys know. Ava, my advice to you, and I do it with my kids, my advice to you, Ava, every day, every day, get up, have breakfast, brush your teeth, brush your hair, get changed for school. I, again, if I said make my bed, make your bed, then go down and do school. That's my advice to you. I still recommend getting dressed every single day out of your pajamas. That's just my, my thoughts. You need, you got to get yourself into a routine. So I recommend you do those things. You get up, get breakfast, make your bed, brush your teeth, brush your hair, get dressed for the day and you'll feel refreshed. You know what I'm saying? It's uh, it's just regular diet Coke. You know, I'd rather have Coke zero, but my wife got it for me. So I'm not going to yell at her. Yes. Bells. I'll go over number 12. Yep. Matt, I, Maddie Johnson. I know. Many, many people believe that, that, that we might not be going back. I just want us to remain positive because I, I need to go back. I just need to go back. Maddie, that's great. I don't know what your, what the shower, taking showers is throw that in there every morning too. Some people rather take them at night though. So whatever, whatever your pattern is, but my kids take showers in the morning before they work also. Yeah, whatever your routine is. I love – make sure you – whatever your routine is, I don't care what it is, have a routine. You need to have a routine. You need to be motivated. You got to have something in your head that you say, okay, I got to do this now. Yeah. Otherwise, you end up sitting playing video games all day or sitting on the couch all day watching TV. You need to have a routine. You know, uh, it's very important that you have a routine. Daniel, do not stay up all night with my schoolwork. You crazy? Don't you do it. Don't you do it. Let's see what's playing on, on the radio. We'll see. Let's see what I got. That's tuned up. Let me see. What all I got here? Let's see. Look at this song. You guys know this song? Everything is Still love. 
Now listen to this song. It's called Alive. Listen to what it's saying. Yes, it's about feeling alive no matter what the circumstances. He's thankful for every breath he takes and he won't take it for granted. So he learns from his mistakes. That's one of my favorite songs. Let me see what else I got on the agenda today. Let's see. Mm. Ah, this one here is from Ireland. Listen to this one. Mixing it up a little bit. That took us through. Because her hair was black and her eyes were blue. Now that's called Galway Girl. It's about the singer uh, met his wife in Ireland. And uh, he wrote a song about it. It's one of my favorite, favorite songs. My wife's from Comac, so I switched the words. Instead of uh, I met a girl from Galway, I met a girl from Comac. She doesn't like when I sing, though, so it doesn't really work. She don't really care. How about... Oh, you guys know this song. This is one of my favorites. It's been more than a week. You guys know this song? So, what do you think? You know that song? You don't like it. Ali, you don't like that song? Aliyah. Jack, you know that song. All right. So that's my singing for today. Now, uh, let me go. Uh, Isabella was waiting patiently while we had our concert tour there. And she wants to hear, uh, see question 12. Let me see if I can find question 12 for Isabella. Isabella, if you could only see the way. Isabella. What? Isabella. The subtraction question? Mm. Isabella. Take a look, guys. I see those all caps, Aaliyah. Be making fun of my music, Aaliyah. All caps saying I don't like it. Cavs rock toy. I like. Hey, real quick, take a look at this one, guys. Thank you, Kira. Okay, so this was rounded to the nearest tenth. Isabella, are you here? I'm not going to go through this question unless you're here. Is Isabella here? Should be implied. Well, yeah. Sorry, Maddie. That stinks. Isabella. Yeah, okay, look. You rounded to the nearest tenths, right? So that's this column right there, right there. So this five tells the nine to go up, but I have to regroup it, right? So nine and 9,500 hundredths regroups. Five tells the nine to go to 10, but the 10 has to regroup to the one. So right, it has how to do that. So now it's a zero here and I regroup the one. So now it ends up being 10 decimal zero, zero. That's what that rounds it to the nearest 10. Minus. What is the what is the six tell the four to do? To go up, right? 
Everything to the left stays the same. So I get 1.5. Right? And then I subtract. I make sure I line my decimals up. Looks like that. And then I just subtract. Voila. Me and Ryan, this is one of the ones Ryan and I did this morning. Well, I almost threw my uh, computer out the window. Right, Ry? In true Kavanaugh form. There's been in my pop. Okay. Isabel, you good with that one? I'm getting the okay sign. Ryan, it's yes, yes, yes. No more talk about the Islanders. The Islanders are done. They're not playing. We'll be lucky if the Mets play. We'll be lucky if the... Let's be honest. We will not be lucky if the Jets play. Because even if they do play, we're not going to be lucky. Can we watch Bob Ross? He is so calming. Well, let's see what I can find for Bob Ross here. I'm taking requests now. That's what we're working on. On today's State of the Classroom, Bob Ross. What has Bob Ross got going on today? Nothing, because he's unfortunately not around anymore, but. This is a Bob. Here we go. I got some Bob Ross. Position is the best way to learn, practice, and master the guitar. Just grab your acoustic or electric and play along. Little trees. I can hear now. These a little closer. You're seeing a little more detail. A little more distinct. There. And we just drop them in. We don't know where they go. Wherever you want them. That's exactly, exactly where they should live. Don't put too much detail in here. It's too far away. You're not going to see a lot of detail. You see detail when it's very close to you. It is, it is very calming. I'm very calm right now. Shape, basic color. That's all. Save your detail to the foreground. Okay, anybody who typed no to Bob Ross, we're going to have you do a Bob Ross assignment. How about that? Especially Aliyah is going to do five of them. How about that, Aaliyah? Adonis. I agree. I can't, I'm not a Spice Girls fan either. But for the girls, you know, you do what you have to do for them. Dean, they are trees. They're pretty cool. If you, think, you actually watch one of his videos, it's pretty, he's a pretty good artist. Bobby, I don't know the Chicken Nugget song, so I'm not going to play it just in case there's something in there that's inappropriate. But I will review it for next episode of State of the Classroom. Don't you leave me, Adonis. Don't you leave me. All right, so tomorrow the book. Tomorrow's book. Oh, are you excited to hear what book we're going to be reading? Some of you read it already, I bet. But it doesn't matter. It's a fifth grade book. And we will read it. It will be the greatest. The Unparalleled, one of the best books around. The book we are going to read, Yeah, Earthworm Sally. What? Is. It's Wonder. Yeah, you read it before, but you've never listened to it. Read by Kavanaugh Extraordinaire. It's going to be awesome. And you're going to love it. And Mr. Kavanaugh is going to cry at least four times. I'm going to have to walk away from the screen. And you're going to say, oh, my gosh. Is he, is he crying again? Is he crying again? Yes, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. And then we'll watch the movie together. Now, maybe we'll be lucky enough to be back at school and we can watch the movie together. The movie's awesome. The book is 
10 times better. The only movie that I think is equal to the book was Tuck Everlasting. The book for one that blows out way the movie. I didn't love the movie. I love the book. Julia did a happy dance. Aaliyah's laughing, which is good, instead of screaming at me. Daniel, it's like the movie, but it's the movie miss, misses out on so many good parts. Ava, you crying? Come on. Of course. You crying is like me crying. You're an emotional kid like me. You have a lot of caring feelings. What is Adonis saying? You, Adonis, don't get mad at me when I cry, Adonis. Don't you dare. Spice Girls, no, really. I cry. You, Kira, have you read it before? It's very good. Dean, it's not, it's not really something that happens in this kind of book. It's just life. And sometimes life makes you cry, especially when you see kids going through things that are difficult. Coco, for, I can't watch Coco. What's the, movie, what's the movie I like? What's the one I like with the Day of the Dead? What is that called again? Forgot what that's called. You know the movie I'm talking about? That I like the cartoon movie with all the singing, the day of the dead. He goes back and he comes back to life and he's a cartoon. The book. I knew I liked you, Bobby. I knew I liked you. Ava, you too. You're on the game. The book of life is a great, great movie. Sis wins. Yes, Melissa. Well done. The book of life, Maddie. Yep. Coco's tough for me. Did you guys watch the new movie Upward? Is that what it's called? Upward? Has anyone seen that yet? I know Disney. What is it called? Onward. My wife says it's called Onward. Have you seen Onward yet? Disney Plus is having it for free, I think. Onward, Dean. Have you seen it? Isabella, did you cry? I know Dean didn't cry. I know Aaliyah didn't cry. Ava didn't see it yet. Onward, Adonis, you didn't. Adonis didn't cry. Maddie Johnson, maybe. I don't know about Matt. Jack, you loved it? I heard it was very, very sad. Don't give away any clues. I heard it was very. Yeah, if your mom cried, then I'm definitely crying. It wasn't sad at all. I, I heard people were like sobbing, Dean. Disney Plus. I'm going to watch it, I think. I'll watch it tonight. I was on the edge yelling. Don't give out any hints, Isabel, whatever that means. Daniel loved it. That's a great review right there. Jack, you, I'm going to I'm gonna show you some movies that will make you cry, Jack. No spoilers, please. Thank you, Adonis. Not kidding. You will be muted if there's a spoiler. I only cry to movies when yes, Aaliyah. Yes. When animals die, cannot handle it. Star Wars. Star Wars. Kidding me? Crying at Star Wars. Oh, my Valentina was crying. Dean, I know you love your Star Wars. I've never got into it. Never was a Star Wars fan. I can't watch Dog's Purpose. I can't watch the Marley movie. What's Robox, Jack? Sad. We would cry. Who would cry? Apparently, Dean cried a little bit during Star Wars. Maybe Luke Skywalker didn't make it. He lost a, 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 a lightsaber fight. I haven't seen part two, Jumanji. I've seen part one. I never watched The Mandalorian either. Natalie was scared of Onward. I could see that being scary. Han Solo was cool. Dean, I will give you that. Christian never saw Dog's Way Home. Roblox Money, never never know even know what you're talking about with Roblox Money. Is that like a game? A game I can't stand?
<laughs> oh, you're funny, Aaliyah. Julia in pieces or peace as in P-E-A-C-E? -E? He died in pieces. That's a little different than dying in peace. I think I'm going to watch uh, Upward. What's it called? Onward? Onward tonight. What else is going on? What else is going on? It's better than Fortnite. I am not talking your, your whack video games. I can't stand any of those. They're not allowed in this house. Peace. Okay, that's better, Julia. That's better. All right. Avengers Endgame was good. I cried when, I don't want to give out a spoiler, but you know when I cried. Kira, you'd definitely cry at on what I bet. I bet you should watch it on. I'm going to watch it tonight, I think. I'm going to play a little chess, guys. I told you that, right? I'm going to come back and whoop everybody in chess. I've been I've been working at it. No, no, I saw Endgame. I liked Endgame. Yeah, Dan, you know me well, Daniel. I'm definitely going to going to be uh, eating a box of tissues. Chess, yes. I've been playing some chess lately, Dean. Looking to whoop, trying to work on my uh, brain power. Chess is a good way to do that. But I'm going to whoop everybody in chess. I'm going after Daniel and Preston. That's who I'm going after. I didn't see Preston at all today. I think I yelled at him earlier today about something, but I haven't heard back from him. All right. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'll make sure it's tissues, Isabella. Agree. Can't be wasting toilet paper on tears. Good, good point. What spy movie, Jack? Allie, I'll take you down too in chess. Don't you worry. You think you're good at it? I'm going to be the master next time you see me. Julie, I don't watch anything Star Wars. Oh, Bobby, please. I'll beat you. I'll, I'll play you with a blindfold on. Don't worry, Isabel. I'm sure you could take on Bobby. <laughs> Ryan, two blindfolds. I'll take you on, Ryan. Two blindfolds. You don't know what I'm up to right now. Speaking of great movies, there's a great movie out about chess called Searching for Bobby Fisher. It's about a kid your age that's like a chess wizard. Very good movie. Searching for Bobby Fisher. <laughs> How do you not watch Star Wars? I don't know. I'm, I was never into Star Wars. Jack, but this is you should use this time, Jack, to practice something like chess. It's a sport. It's a game you can always use in your life. Oh, Ryan is good, huh? Bobby, again, the self-proclaimed chess wizard. Oh, Isabel, Isabel, you are good. Maybe I'll look into that. Maybe I'll start a chess club on Google Classroom. Christian, you were, you were one of the best goalers I've seen in the last 10 years. No doubt about it. But Matty Johnson did score on you a bunch. I watched all Star Wars movies in the last two years. I got into it. Same. Dylan is good at chess. I bet Dylan's good at chess. Darth Maul was cool. You are not a chess wizard, Bobby. Ryan, no trash talk. Save the trash talk for me. You know Bobby's going to get motivated. Save the trash talk for Kavanaugh. That's it. All right, guys. We're about 40 minutes in. This was pretty cool, but I got to do some uh, barbecuing. Got to get going with dinner. It's almost 5 o'clock, and uh, we got to stay on the uh, agenda with the family. All right, so State of the Union, very happy with you guys. School's going great. I want you to make sure you're out of your pajamas every single day. Medieval times is a great question, Ava. I don't know. I, we didn't can I didn't cancel it yet, if that's what you're asking me. A little chicken, little chicken, Julia, making a little chicken, chicken breasts on the, on the grill. 
I am not Julia Madonna. I love you to pieces. I am not watching the Mandalorian. I have I'll, I'll end up like this. Not watching it. I watch Peppa Pig though, Daniel. That show I like. I like Peppa Pig. A little steak. I'm not gonna have steak tonight, but I'm gonna have some chicken. Burgers. I like burgers. I'd rather have chicken though. Burgers, little little cheeseburger, little mac and cheese, cheeseburger. Not bad. I made the best egg sandwiches of all time this morning, though. I'm going to listen to Earthworm Sally. That I will do. Chicken's my favorite as well. Peppa is no joke. We love Peppa. Very cool. I love steak. As soon as you see the child, you will fall. I know. I know. The little Yoda guy, I, he's, he's cute. But how, what am I going to watch him for? I'll see a picture of him. He's cute. All right. So, oh, you know what I forgot to do, guys, that I got to do today? Now that I got so many of you here, just say yes. I'm going to write your name down right now and send it to you right now. Who? Everybody's here. If you want to be in this book that we're in the read-alouds, just say yes right now. And I'm going to add your name and send you a sentence today to start with. If you want to be in this book, Maddie, I'll finish steak quicker than an hour. Okay, I got Ava. I got Julia. I got Bobby. Wow, good. Look at this. Look at this. Awesome. Ava, Julia, Bobby, Julia, Matt Johnson, Isabella. Julia, how many yeses do I have there? Aaliyah, yes, I got you already. Don't double, double tap. Yes, yes, yes. Dean, no good for you? Come on, Dean. And what about Adonis? Adonis, please. Thank you, Adonis. Yes. Right. Don't give me small sentences. You get what you get. You don't get upset. Thank you, Daniel. Thank you, Allie. Dean, I still don't see a yes there for you, Dean. I'm watching you, Dean. Thank you, Kira. Thank you, Dean. <laughs> Tell your dad. When I get bored at home, I give myself a haircut. But only because I knew it was grow back by the time I saw you guys. It's probably not even even. If he wants to come over haircut, free of charge for dad. Tell him. Free of charge. <laughs> no, I'm gonna I'm letting it grow back now. I'm letting it grow back. You never know, though. I might get a little crazy. I might, uh, you know, I've been bald before. I had a good head of hair. You see no bald spots. Pretty good. So I, I can I can play around with my hair. I was blessed with a good head of hair. Mine is so long. My kid, my son's hair is so long, and I'm going to shave it when he's sleeping. Can't stand it. All right. All right, guys. We good for today? 45-minute chat. We're calling this the state of the classroom instead of the state of the union. Remember we talked about the State of the Union when the president gets up and talks about where the country is? We're doing our State of the Classroom. We'll have one of these a week. I know. We could talk forever. You guys enjoy the rest of your day. Hopefully you went out a little bit. That's what Gwen told me. You always change it. I do always change my hair. It's very true. D Daniel, I don't have hair like you. You do not shave your hair. It's perfect. I wish I had hair like you. I'm going to send you the sentences right now. So look, as soon as I log off, I'm going to log in to sentences. All right, I'm going to send it to everyone who said yes, including my buddy Dean. So proud of you, Dean. And Ryan, extra long sentence you wanted, right? Super long? I'll make sure you get that one, right, right? Okay? See you tomorrow. Wonder.